Hello and welcome to all my lords and ladies out there in this wonderful kingdom. I'm Lady Emerald and today we are going to be playing Elder Scrolls V Skyrim Special Edition. <laughs> uh, welcome back. Um, so yeah, we left off in Riverwood. Uh, we were just talking to... Uh, uh, what was his name? Hadvar's uncle? Is that a dog? That's a, that's a giant ass dog. Uh, his uncle. Is he over here? No? It's nighttime. Maybe he's inside. He's probably sleeping with his wife. Alvar. Alvar. So we just got done talking to him. Um, apparently we need to bring news to Whiterun. Oh, side eye. Need, wow. Within reason, of course. Yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll take what I need within reason. So yeah, he had said that we need to that we need to go to Whiterun and warn the Yarl about the dragon, so that Riverwood can be protected with more soldiers. Um. So, that's what we're supposed to do. Not what we're gonna do, but that's where we that's where we left off. So. Oh, hello, Sid. Oh, I will. I will. Oh, hunting bow. Wow, you got such nice stuff. I'll give you that. Just oh. stay away from my husband, Alvar. So much jealous. It's my cat like charm. I'll take this. You don't know. You can't see me. She has no idea. She has no idea. She has no idea. Well, the two things I just took, uh, you can't actually steal, so. Oh, she knows. She know. Ooh, what this nice stone. Ooh, did you tan? Did you tan this yourself? Impeccable craftsmanship, my lady. Impeccable. Literally, all the things I've taken so far have not been stolen. But I want this. She can see. Yeah, my lady, incredible craftsmanship. This is such a beautiful hide. Stop looking at me, little girl. Did you really see a dragon? No. Yeah. yeah. I love to steal stuff, you guys. Ooh. It's a good potion. Oh, nah. Okay, guys, we're gonna pickpocket. We need to quick save because this doesn't always work. Key to Alvar's house. Do I need it? No, but the skill. <laughs> she didn't see anything. Make yourself at home. Oh yeah, making myself making myself right at home. Definitely, for sure. I want this bow, lady. Go away. Just go away now. Where do you go? Where do you go? Okay, cool. Oh, she moves. Did you really see a dragon? No. <sighs> My character doesn't like children. I'm role playing that. I love to roleplay, it's fun. I play D&D. I like roleplaying. I wanna take everything. Oh yeah, I need potatoes for that recipe that I was talking about. I don't know if everything's in here though. I did not want the plate. Didn't want that either. All right, let's see what it, ooh, wait a minute. Okay, let's see what this, uh, this stew I was talking about last episode requires. Cooking. Cooking pots allow you to cook food that stores, restores your health and provides other temporary effects. Each recipe requires specific culinary ingredients that can be found throughout Skyrim. Phenomenal. All right, uh, I think it's at the bottom. Potato soup? No, I think it's vegetable soup. Yeah, this one is pretty good. 
I mean, potato soup can be good too. That's 10 points of health and we don't really have much health right now. So we can make, uh, yeah, let's make some of that. But for the other one, we need cabbage and tomatoes. So we need that. Tomatoes. Potatoes. You know, boil them, mash them, you know. Put them in a stew. <laughs> uh, I make myself laugh. All right, let's explore out here. Let's maybe talk to some people. Well, what time is it? Eh, it's pretty, oh, it's late, it's dark. You know what that means. Time for some thievery, if you know what I mean. Let's go in this house. Sven. Ah, that's that weird looking dude I saw, the blonde hair. I was like, I don't like the look of you, boy. Okay, so not, see how it jiggled there? So let's go this way a little bit. Oh, oh, jiggled too much. Maybe a little bit like right here. I'm a genius. I'm a genius. Let it be known. Let it be known throughout this hole that Lady Emerald is magnificent. Only one person's here? Okay, okay, that's cool, that's cool. <gasps> Who saw me? Who saw me? I can move slowly. My sneak's not high enough yet. There we go. It's going up though. Also, when I make stuff for like blacksmithing, I love to get like the blacksmith apron and whatnot. Just so I really feel like a blacksmith when I'm upgrading my weapons. <laughs> I didn't want the tankard. That's cool. That's cool. Barrel empty. That's cool. Slowly, I'm going. I don't know why I'm whispering because she can't hear me. Uh, I'm going slowly because when your when your sneak is not high enough level, if you move too fast, um, they they will notice you. Oh yeah, I got a quick save, or else. <sighs> I'm sorry if you think I save scum, but <gasps> oh, she's got a garnet. Oh, I'm taking it. Oh no! Oh, oh no! You don't. Fine. I have a lot of saves. As I have a lot of people, as you can see, that I've played as. <laughs> Emerald. Yeah. This might, this might take a little bit. I want the garnet. Yeah, yeah. Okay, we're gonna save again just because the pickpocket can get a little tricky and we gotta level up. That's awesome. Uh, yeah, I am gonna quick. S I okay, so whenever I pickpocket, I will be like consistently quick saving just because that's a skill I like to increase quickly. Um, it's an easy skill to increase uh, and it helps with just getting more skill points that you can use for other things because I don't necessarily put things into pickpocket just because there's not really a need to. Um, if you have a potion and your skill is high enough, you should be able to pickpocket unless there are like specific skills that you want in that. Didn't she have a ring? Oh yeah, it's right here. Okay, cool, cool, cool. I like to pickpocket the like bigger stuff because then that'll increase the skill. Let's do the 18 gold. Cool, so we'll, we won't get another in, we, we won't, we won't get another increase, but that's okay. We having fun tonight! <laughs> Could you imagine though? That's a lot of wine. Oh, come on. Come on. Give it to me. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> oh, oh! No! Run! Is there anything else in here? Nah, I don't think so. Okay, cool. You're not supposed to be in here. Thank you. 
What was her name? Hild? Hilda? Sven and Hilda, I think? <laughs> yeah, Hilda. Shut up, Hilda! Crazy woman. Do not kill the chickens, alright? Don't do it. It's not worth it. It's just not. I don't care if they pick at your ankles. Don't do it. The risk outweighs the reward. Who saw me? I got a text message. From my mom. Mama bear. Thistle. Sorry if I move too fast. I try not to move too, too fast. Fane doll. Ooh. Okay, so let's go a little bit more. I, I think it's so funny when I see YouTubers that have a really hard time with this. Uh, but it's also not everyone's cup of tea either, so... I don't blame them. I just really enjoy it. I think it's fun. Okay, let's slowly... Ooh. Oh yeah, maybe. I'm gonna need a house. Like ASAP. Yeah, if, if you see a pelt, grab the pelt, okay? Pelts are gonna help with um your smithing increase. So I highly suggest um Picking up any pelt you find, really making that a priority if that's what you want to increase. That's just an axe? Okay, cool. Um, and I also try to, if I see like a wolf, obviously a wolf will attack you, but like a deer or something, or a fox, I try to, I try to kill it just out in the wilderness so I can get that pelt. Just because they really come in handy. If you need leather, just so you're not buying a ton of leather. I don't want that. Don't go in. I don't want the thing. Okay, basket. And I know I picked up something else. Tinkered, yeah, and a wooden plate. I don't want that either. <gasps> Too fast. Slow it down. Slow. Why? Are there any sweet rolls? What's that? Control fast. Cool. Why am I whispering? <laughs> You don't see anything, Fane doll. <gasps> is there someone else in here? <laughs> Man, my sneak is not good. As long as he doesn't wake up, that's cool. Okay, cool. Wow. Well, let's just try to pickpocket him before we get caught. I just want to see, I want to see what that book is over there. The book. You little thief. Ah! Oh, I'm not little. Why is Emerald all the way down here? Why can't it be at the top? Yes, I failed once again. Yes, I know. I know. I know. Malakath. Daedric Prince. You're not getting anything from me. Yes, I will. I can do it. I can do it. I know I can. <laughs> Bear with me. All right, you got this. You're not getting anything from me. What do those YouTubers say? Oh, I'll just cut it out. No, I want you to see. I want you to see the attempts. This is what I go through. This is how you get it done. You can always just skip ahead anyways. I don't care. <gasps> yes! See? A success. And then we quick save just to make sure. What the, what is that book? Oh. Hmm. <gasps> I just can't. Oh, 
Gems, gems, beautiful gems. I love gems. Oh, let's book it. Let's ba 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 book it. Ba 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 book it. Ooh, an owl. God, I love Skyrim. Like that little owl sound effect. Like that's nice. They didn't have to put. They didn't have to put that in here. Todd didn't have to put that in here. That's a big dog. How do I get in here? Oh, <laughs> this way. Hello, arch nemesis. Take your egg. You don't deserve this egg. Take the egg. I swear, I can do it. Really, the cow notices me? <laughs> That's luck, baby. That's luck. Uh, fuck you, kid. That kid's gonna see me and be like, you're not supposed to be in here. Oh, uh, I have to edit that out. Darn it. The boob tube doesn't like the F words anymore. How, how do you how do you bleep it out? A task for a different day, I suppose. Yeah, that there's no way that kid's not gonna see me. My sneak is nowhere near where I want it to be right now. Um okay, let's 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 just go well, I can sleep here for free, so let's sleep here. Why was it locked? It should be locked for me. I belong in here. Keep an eye out for trouble. <gasps> oh God. It's only a matter of time. You scared me. That far. So yeah, we'll just sleep here. We'll just sleep for... Seven hours? Yeah, that should be eight. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, because eight, seven plus one is eight. <laughs> so yeah, um, everything usually opens at like 8 a.m. Closes at 8 p.m. ish. I think. So that's the time when you want to steal stuff is after 8 p.m. Take what you is? need, my friend. Within reason. What do you want? Have a drink on me, bro. Got any ale or mead? Yeah, I got. Shh. Got tons, man. I got tons. All right then. Wow, that's my it. That's all I get. Drinking buddy. Oh, Let's now I'm your favorite meat. drinking buddy. Okay, cool. Whatever, bro. Till next time. Till next time, my ass. Okay, I'm pretty sure you can take you can take all these iron ignits. Ignit? Ignit? Ing ingot? Ingot! There we go. <laughs> I forgot how to say it. <laughs> okay, that's cool. I'm gonna take this steel dagger. Um. I'll probably do like a bow and then like two daggers um, as like my weapon. Weapons. So, yeah. So tanning rack. The tanning rack is used to turn animal hides to leather and to cut leather into strips. Both leather and leather strips are used in creating and improving weapons and armor. Phenomenal. Fantastic. That's what I like to see. So yeah, this is what I'm talking about. So the saber cat pelt will give you four leather. Is that what that means? I think so. Um, the cowhide will give you three, and then just the wolf pelt will just give you one. Um, so yeah. And then once you have leather, then you can make leather strips. Um, so we'll make. That should be good. Four, eight. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Um, yeah, let's let's make some stuff. Well, first off, he's using something I want to use. Get off. Get off. Thank you. May the gods watch over your battles, friend. Well, okay. <laughs> Sorry, bro. Hold on. Let's use this first. The blacksmith forge is used to create new weapons and armor from raw materials. So you're gonna find a lot of um ingots throughout Skyrim. Um, and you can also mine for them as well. Um, you'll see like an ore vein. 
either out in the wilderness, in a cave, in a lots of places. But you'll need a pickaxe for that to be able to even do that. Uh, but you can get raw materials that way and then you just go to a forge, create it into ignis- ig- How do I say this word? Ingot? <laughs> Um, and then from there you can use it to make this kind of stuff. So let's, so we're gonna make this. Not bad. Reminds me when I first started sniffing. Oh, I see how it is. I see, I see. Boots and then a bracer. Let's do that. Um, we don't need that yet. We don't need... Gross. Okay, so we did that. Do we have more leather now to improve it? Okay, using workbenches to improve armor. All improvements require materials. The amount of improvement depends on your smithing skill. Thirty. Wait. <laughs> no. See, if I improve that, it only goes to twenty-seven. But if I improve my leather armor, it'll go to 30, so that's gonna be better. So let's improve that. And then we'll improve the boots, and then we'll improve the bracers, and whatnot. I don't know why I didn't use the blacksmith potion I have in my inventory. That's fine though. So basically, whenever you're doing this, you're gonna you're gonna want a potion at least. Um, you can buy them, you can make them. This is what I like to do, okay? You get your alchemy app, you make the blacksmithing potions, okay? Well, first, actually, beginning. You use the alchemy <laughs> to get better at enchanting, and then once you get better at enchanting, well, you use the alchemy to make enchanting um, potions that will help you to better your enchanting stuff which you'll also want to be improving and putting skills into your enchanting because that's what i like to do as well enchanting alchemy smithing you want skills in those and then you keep doing that and then use your enchanting to make stuff for alchemy and for blacksmithing and then it just goes into a circle okay because obviously each time you make something with like a potion for say enchanting and then you make something for alchemy it's gonna be better and then you have that that you use for the alchemy and then you make a potion that will be better and then you bring that back to the smithing and then to the enchanting and it's just like this like circle and that's how you literally make your shit OP which is what I like to do that was a mouthful um, so yeah we won't we're obviously not gonna do that right now because we don't we don't have the skill to do that right now that's okay I just wanted to show you guys kind of how you do it and then we're gonna equip what we made see now i look snazzy uh, yes emerald lady mm -hmm. doth lady weareth her robes just kidding armor i'm gonna wear robes cool yeah that looks so much better than the imperial armor okay take what you need my friend Within now we picked up a steel dagger and some steel ingots so we're gonna improve that along with the hunting bow looks like we can improve as well that's cool use the grindstone to improve weapons all improvements require specific materials which you can buy or find in the world phenomenal thank you so yeah we'll improve that Select. yeah so yeah it goes f i forget all the levels i think it's a like fine and then adapter Wow, I can't remember it. I can't remember it. You basically want your stuff to be legendary. You'll get to a point with your smithing where it's gonna be legendary. <laughs> Legend, wait for it. Dairy. That's what you want. Okay, let's improve this. And also, when you're on the grindstone and on uh, and improving your armor as well. And at the forge, like all of that is going to be improving your smithing skill. So, doing this helps us. Even if I'm, I'm not going to use this iron dagger. That's okay. We'll improve it though. It's our skill up a little bit, and then we'll just go into our inventory. Go to weapons. We'll 
Oh, well, we still want that. But we'll unfavor the longbow and we'll favor the hunting. That's nine. This is at a seven. Pfft, garbage. We don't want that. Okay. Let's talk to the shopkeeper. That bird scared me. Where'd it go? You can shoot birds, you know. With an arrow? If you get it right, you can take it down. It's tricky, but... So the Riverwood Trader. Well, one of us has to do something. I said no. No adventures, no theatrics, no thief chasing. Well, I didn't do anything, do then, I swear. Huh? Let's hear it. We are done talking about this. Oh. <clears throat> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Sorry you had to hear that. Oh, yeah, no problem. She looks pissed, though, dude. I don't know what you overheard, but the Riverwood Trader is still open. Feel free to You shop. don't know what I heard? You didn't see me open the door? You're facing me. The Riverwood Trader is everything you need in a general store. Did something happen? Uh, what yeah, happened? We, we did have a, a bit of a, a break-in. We, we still have plenty to sell. Robbers were only after one thing. An ornament. Solid gold in the shape of a dragon's solid claw. Solid gold, you say? Dragon's claw. I, I I could help you get the dragon back. Dragon, I mean. Oh, I could help you get the claw back. You could? I could. I've got some coin coming in from my last shipment. Oh, perfect. It's yours if you bring my claw back. Now, if you're going to get those Ooh. thieves, you should head to Bleak Falls Barrow, northeast of Oh, town. that scary-ass place? Never yes. mind. I don't want so it anymore. you don't have to go, do you? <laughs> Oh really? Well, I think your new helper here needs a guide. No, really, I know where it no, is. I, I don't. I don't need any eight. help. Okay. Fine. I got it. To the edge I'm a cat. Town. I'm very, very well aware. My. It's okay. Do I have to follow her? Should I follow her? She can just walk out there by Show herself. those thieves not to steal from Luke and Valerius. Okay, mister. Your voice seems very familiar, like I've heard it before. Trinkets, odds, odds and, ends, and ends, that well, sort well, of thing. Items above the divider line, below to the vendor. Items above... <laughs> Okay. Items above the divider line belong to the vendor. Items below the line belong to you. To buy or sell an item, select it and then press X. Because <clears throat> I'm using PS4. Um, I understood it. Just when I read it, I was like, what the heck does it mean? Um, well, let's see what he has. Let's just... Weapons. Cool. Nothing. Well, he has arrows. Steel arrows. I'll find him. It's fine. You can also make arrows with the special edition. Um, the update they had or whatever. Whenever that was. Uh, you, you can make arrows. You need firewood and then the ingots. So. I never buy anything, really. I think it's kind of a little pointless to buy stuff. I just like to look to see. Was that a smithing? No. Okay. Smithing stuff is hard to find sometimes. So if you come across anything that's smithing, um, I would recommend buying it. I, I would say the only things that I would probably buy were anything that has to do with enchanting, anything that has to do with alchemy, or smithing. Um, just because I feel like when I need them the most or when I'm actually actively looking for them, I cannot find them for the life of me. So if you come across it, snag it up so that you can use it when the time comes that you're ready to um, start doing that stuff. I will buy the health potions, however, just because I don't... Oh, 53. I mean, I'm gonna need them. Oh, fine. I'll only buy two. Just I don't have a blister wart and wheat quite yet. And sometimes it's hard to come across that. Like, a lot of it at the very beginning. Um, I'll try to use some spells. 
Yeah, we'll use some spells, you know. Ooh, soul gem. Yeah, you'll need soul gems for um, enchanting and whatnot. But I usually like to... Uh, you can find just empty ones fairly easy, and then you can also pretty much find anything that has a soul trap enchantment on it that you can then disenchant and put whatever you want, put the enchantment on whatever you want. And I, and I like to do that using the bow because then you, you can just shoot them and then, oh, I got the soul. <laughs> the grand souls, those, 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 those are the good ones. Those are the good ones. Lockpick, I might need that. That's okay. Let's sell some stuff though. We don't need the iron dagger, so we're gonna sell that. For now, we'll hang on to the iron sword. We don't need the long bows. And the hunter bow was hunting bow? The hunting bow was stolen, so it's not gonna show up in his inventory because he can't buy stolen stuff. <laughs> Oops sell all those. We'll sell the fur boots that we picked up. All the... Um, all the stuff we found in the in the cave says we were escaping Alduin the dragon. We'll disenchant this stuff, so I'm gonna hang on to it. I'm gonna sell this ring. I don't need the ring. Please, as well. Yeah. See, like, 32. That's that's not bad just from what I've picked up from the dragon till now. Like, that's not bad, you know? And I... Let's pick up I never sell my ingredients. Never sell your ingredients, okay? That shit's priceless. Same with... Same with this stuff. Don't... I mean, right. I'm not... I'm not telling you how to play the game, but don't sell that stuff, okay? You need that stuff. You need it. I promise you need it. Wow, he has no idea. Not a care in the world. I'm gonna take your gold. I thought he had two. Wait, I want a quick save. Just cause I don't want to just go through all that I just went through. Do I want all these little pieces of gold? Yes. I don't want that. Do I want to pickpocket him? Maybe I'll try. I'll, 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 I'll pickpocket him. Maybe I'll try to take from the chest. Oh, see? Perfect. That's more leather right there. Awesome. Oh, I can't wait to make Daedric stuff. Oh, that looks so cool. Well, I don't know if I'm going to wear Daedric armor. Not going to lie. There's a set. I'm not gonna- I'm not gonna spoil it, but there is a set of armor that you get in the game that I just- <sighs> It's my absolute favorite, and I think it's like a lot of people's favorite set of armor that you get in the game, but that won't be till later on. Um, and by the time I get that armor, I don't even think I'll be able to make Daedric armor anyways, so... I mean, we'll, we'll probably- we'll probably make, like, a set of armor for Daedric in case I get into some heavy, heavy combat stuff. But yeah, you get you get a really nice set of armor that I I just adore. I think it looks so cool. Oh no, you don't! Oh, <laughs> scared me. Oh no, you don't! Oh, that scared me. <laughs> but yeah, I won't spoil it. Don't worry, I won't spoil the armor. And yeah, most of you probably already know what the armor I'm talking about is. But in case you don't, that's fine. That's fine. Think you can steal from- Yes, I do think so. Oh god. I just have to level up. I haven't leveled up yet. Think you can steal from- Ah, uh, you. Yeah. Like I said, I'm showing you. This is how it goes. This is how it goes, baby. This is how it goes. This is the name of the game. I'm 
drinking coffee. Oh, no, you don't. <sighs> Fine. I'll come back to you, though. I'm coming back. Don't you worry. I'll come back a different time. I don't want to stay here forever. I need to take some, some of his gold. Oh, see, this is why you sneak everywhere. Not only because I'm going to steal some shit, but um, yeah, I usually like to s sneak everywhere just because then it's it's kind of actively increasing it, but it's only actively increasing it when people are around, but sometimes you don't know if people are even around. So if you're hidden and you're around people, that sneak skill will increase. So it's just kind of like a bonus. I think everyone should do it. What do you think you're doing? <gasps> Fudge you. Oh, this is this is why you save. Okay, I forgot that he follows you up upstairs if he sees you go upstairs. Well, at least we still got that sneaking skill. That's cool. That's cool. Okay, quickly. Well, I'm in this. He won't. Ah. Oh, and also, if you break um, a lockpick, you can see at the bottom where it says lockpicking, this is 22, and then on the other end it says 23. Even if you break a lock, it'll still slowly um, up your skill. But when you actually unlock it, it'll up, it'll increase it more. But um, at least if you break a lock, you're, it's not totally like wasted. Um, so that's nice. That's nice. That's cool. Bear pelt taking that gold horse hide. Then quickly over here because he's coming. You got to be quick, like lightning. Oh, that was a lucky one. Cool. Goat hide. Yeah, you want that shit. Wow, you have such a nice place. I can't believe it. Wow. Hi, Lucian Vitlarius. What are you doing, bud? <laughs> Sucker. Yeah, that guy looks badass. He's like, he's he's gonna f you up. That's what he's gonna do. We have to go through town and across the bridge to get to Bleak Oh, Falls that's Barrow. right. You can Hi. See it from here, though. The oh. mountain just over the buildings. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Those thieves must be mad hiding out there. Those old crypts are filled with nothing but traps, trolls, and who knows what else. Ooh, ooh, um. Sorry, what? I need to use the bathroom. We're a small village. Oh yeah, I talked to you already. And take care of our own. Oh hello, who are you? Did I? Riverwood's oh, agreeable enough, I, I suppose. From you. For a Nord village, I'll show you what I know. So yeah, you can. Um, there are gonna be people scattered throughout all of Skyrim that you can go to, and they'll train you in like all of the different uh, skill trees, which I'll show you in a minute when I level up. Um, I do that usually only if I'm like really close, like a skill being unlocked, like a certain skill that I want, then I'll do it just so I can like get that certain perk and I'm close to it. If I'm not close to it, I usually don't. I just try and, you know, play the game. Unless it's something that's annoyingly, painstakingly slow, but sometimes I will. But yeah. What's your problem with Sven? That weird guy He's I bumped into earlier? So he says. Oh, okay. Occasionally he finds time to do his job here at the mill. Oh. Thinks his ballads and sonnets are going to convince Camilla Valerius to marry him. As oh, that lady that's yes. That lady that's walking me to the beautiful edge woman of town? like her wouldn't fall for that nonsense. I hope. You hope? Oh. Yeah. I don't you... need your jokes right now. <laughs> but maybe you have a point. Maybe Camilla needs some help seeing Sven for what he is. Could you okay. could you give her this letter and say it's from Sven? What does the I think I've matched say? that Nord's lack of cleverness perfectly. I just heard something in mm -hmm. my Until next time. apartment. Spooky. <laughs> just kidding, it's it's cats. I have cats. They like to get into mischief, you know? <laughs> what does that note say? Fake letter from Sven. Read. 
my dearest Camilla, I yearn to have you as my own, washing my linens and my fine blonde hair. You forgot the Ian blonde. Oh, I, I, oh, I get it because he's not smart. To cook my dinner from my stove and tend to my house while I wander. Yours truly, Sven. How crude. I wonder if he actually, like, Huh, where is Sven? I want to talk to Sven now. I want to see what he uh, has to say. Where is he? Oh, that's right. She still wants me to follow her. Go away. Oh, the doggy. Hello. Whoa. Fuzzy. What's wrong with you? Fuzzy. Oh. Did you just comment on my race, bro? You're kind of fuzzy. What's wrong with you? Do you mean fuzzy? As in I'm blurry because you're drunk, or fuzzy because I'm a cat? So much for sharing drinks with you. What is this? Flying... Uh, Manita? Huh? I found it. It's funny because like I've played this game a million times, but there are a lot of things that I say only in my head and never out loud. So that's always funny to see uh, how that works. <laughs> <gasps> there he is. Hello, Sven. Are you listening? Feindall thinks he can woo Camilla Valerius away from me. She's already mine, I keep telling him. Oh. I didn't know we could own people. Did you hear me? Yep. Hail's going bad. I, guess you I don't want to hear you sing. All right, then. <laughs> Just make sure we get a fresh batch in soon. Potatoes? See potatoes? Hey, you got you got potatoes on you, lady? You're that visitor been poking around. You look familiar. They say a dragon attacked Helgen. Sounds like hogwash to me. I can testify. It was there. Um, we'll look around. Yeah, we'll just look around now. Um, I don't trust Sven. I'm not gonna, I'm gonna, um, quick save. Wait, Delphine's gonna see me. I forgot to save. That's okay. Uh, it'll always have an auto save when you go into a location. Just for one of you. But always quick save. Always quick save. I don't like you. Orgnar. Orgnar, are you listening? Hard not to. The ale is going bad. We need to get a new batch. You're that visitor, Ben poking a- Did you hear me? Yep, ale's going bad. I guess you don't have potatoes She's stuck in, in conversation? Bathroom. Just make sure we get a fresh batch in soon. <sighs> She's stuck in conversation mode! I <laughs> got you! Also, these- Can I just say, these are so cute, okay? Literally- Dogs making weird noise. This is so cute. I mean, like, obviously it's it's Skyrim and like technology is not a thing. But this is a, this is adorable, okay? So cute. I love it. Adorable. Hi! I wasn't doing anything. I was admiring your bed. It actually has You have sheets? Very nice. It's a hard commodity to come by here, that's for sure. Cause see? Drink to our no sheets. To hey, and, gone. and a pelt. Well, the age of aggression is just about done. I sing this shit all the time. And what we own. With our blood and our okay, Alchemy Lab. Let's introduce it. Let's show you what it's all about. You can create potions and poisons by combining combining two or more ingredients that share a common effect. Experiment with different ingredients to learn their effects. Cool. So we don't we don't know anything yet, and it'll show up right here under ingredients if when we know something. So what I like to do is just pick random stuff. Oh, look at that! See, 
And then I just keep doing that. We were worth 11 gold, so we'll clear that, try something else. But this land is ours, and we'll see it. Oh, Look at that! You automatically have a potion that's worth 146 well, it's, you're not going to get 146 because of the, you know, inflation and whatnot. But that's not bad. Alchemy is such an underrated, um, well, I think it's underrated because um, I've, I've watched like other um, <laughs> boob tubers, YouTubers, and they don't really like experiment with alchemy or like enchanting or smithing. And I'm like, <gasps> What are you doing? That's that's the most important thing. Um, and then there are others that I see and they are just a whiz at this stuff. And I'm like, yes. Yes. So yeah, let's uh, keep making uh, some of those. And then we can like sell that and that just increase. Look at that. Boom. Done. But sometimes it fails. That's okay. Uh, let's try... Maybe elf ears. Or... Yeah, no, it's okay. See, so yeah, I I always do this when I get like a. Ooh. Nice. See, so yeah, I always do this when I get like a bunch of ingredients in my menu and it's just like a big list and I just keep doing that where like I just pick three at random and I craft them and yeah it, it goes pretty well for me uh, but you'll find a lot of times uh, like, like, like you'll find actual notes places that will tell you uh, a specific recipe for a potion or a poison and, and you can buy them as well. Um, there there are places where you can buy that as well. And you just look at the note, pick the, find the ingredients if you already have all three of them, then make the potion, and then it'll be saved in your um, alchemy lab. Uh, oh yeah, I already picked that. Yeah. Where'd she go? I thought she was walking over here. Oh, did she, did she give up? That's cool. Camilla, where are you? Yeah, journal. Um, so, PS4, it's the options button. Let me tab over and it'll show you uh, the the quests that you have and then the ones underneath the line that have already been done. So we, we, we did unbound. Um, we're gonna do... not this. Miscellaneous. We're gonna go tell Camilla that this letter is from Sven because we don't like Sven. Sven is a... not a... ah, he screws me up. I just get a vibe from him. I've always liked Feindel better, even though he's like, Yo, can you, like, pretend this is from, from, you know, Sven? Mara bless you for agreeing oh, to help us. Thanks. You're Mara. not from around here. That makes two of us. Oh, really? You, 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 you can tell I'm not from around here? Wow. What, what gave you that idea? Is it the fur? It's the fur, right? Well... I have a letter from you. It's from Sven. Another poem, I bet. Yeah, I bet. Know how to make a girl blush. Yeah. What's this? If that oaf thinks all I'm going to do is stay in that filthy house of his and clean, I'll... You can tell Sven that he already has a mother. I'm not speaking to him anymore. Oh, do you want me to go tell him that? Or are you, do you want to tell him that? For you back in the shop. Okay, cool. All right. Bye. <laughs> Alright, so um, at, at the top you can see that's our compass. It shows our waypoints. Where places are west. There's some mine over there that's undiscovered. If it's discovered, it'll highlight like the town is highlighted. This represents Riverwood, so. We're a small village, but we work hard and take care of our Tell me as soon as you've given Camilla the letter. I don't think Camilla will be spending any more time with Sven. I appreciate your help. Please take this. You're welcome. Some gold I've saved up for more. Ooh, I love gold. I love things that are shiny. Oh, okay. So yeah, uh, there are certain people that will that can be become your companions if you help them, do something for them, pay them. Uh, so since we did this favor for Feindel, he is now our friend, can be our companion. 
Uh, I do utilize companions just because at the beginning I'm not very strong. Um, and I mainly use the bow so my my one-handed doesn't really increase too too much just because I'm a I'm a bow woman, you know? Uh, so yeah. I, I, and I usually take Feindal with me because I don't really care if he dies and he can die. Just so you know. Oh, Man, we're gonna spend this whole episode just in this little hunky-dory town. That's okay. Uh, before I end the episode, I am gonna go over the skill tree really quickly. Level up. We're gonna level up and we're gonna do when your level increases, you must choose to increase your health, magicka, or stamina. You can also select a new perk at this time or save it for later. Available perks are highlighted in each constellation. Love this setup. I think it's beautiful. Fantastic. I'm gonna choose health because <laughs> I need health. I'll probably do health, stamina, health, stamina, magic every third or fourth. Um, but yeah, I just, I love this. This is beautiful, phenomenal. I mean, like the blue to represent like like the magic skill tree, the like dark red to represent like, I just, I just love it, it's beautiful. Okay, so you have different skill trees and these are gonna be, um, you, you have a lot of them. So yeah, alchemy is definitely one that's key. Potions and poisons you make are 20% stronger. We're not gonna unlock that right now, just because I like to put some stuff into my sneak and my archery right away, just because that's what I'll be utilizing most at first. For one, I'm going to put it in my sneak. Well, yeah, I'm going to put it in my sneak. You are 20% harder to detect when sneaking. Absolutely. We're going to use this. And honestly, we'll probably gain quite a few levels before we even go out trying to kill stuff. Just because I like to get some perks under my belt before I like to go into caves and shit. Cause I, I really like the town life. <laughs> the town life. The city life. I'm a city gal. Uh, basically going around, talking to people. Stealing stuff, pickpocketing, you know, the fun stuff. I love doing that. Um, so I like to get a few perks under my belt before I go out. Uh, so yeah, you can put more perks into bows as well. That'll be our, probably our second. But um, So you can do this when your archery... Well, this at first. And then, like, this one will require your, your archery to be at 30. So the skill level will have to be at 30 to increase this. And then, you know, so on and so forth. Yeah, really great. These skill trees are awesome. I love them. But my main ones that I focus on that I think are important are going to be the alchemy. Enchanting and smithing. Okay, these are these are key if you want to have a fun... Well, I mean, to each your own. You don't have to do this. You don't have to follow what I say. This is just what I do and what I like to do to have fun. Um, like I've said before. And enchanting is a uh, buttermilk card to get <laughs> higher up. Um, it's definitely slow for sure. It's a hard one, I feel like, to get the actual percentage of skill on a weapon. You have to really have it at a higher thing. Because, um, like, for, for example, I'll, I'll show you. This apparel, uh, like this one, it says Magicka regenerates 50% faster. If you're at like, like right now, if I were to make, try to make this right now, it would literally only give me magic or regenerates at like 3% faster. Um, so it is a tough one to, to get up there, but it's, it's fun. Like, like I said. So yeah, that's the skill tree. And like, I'll, I'll definitely be go, going over it more as we increase uh, our, our level, our skills, as we go throughout the game. But yeah. And don't worry, in the next episode, we will leave this godforsaken little tiny town where my arch nemesis, the chicken, is everywhere. <sighs> yeah. Thank you all for watching so much. I appreciate it. If you liked the video, you can like, subscribe. If you didn't like it, that's fine. Let me know in the comments if you didn't like it. Or if I could change, do something better. Just let me know. <gasps> Ooh, leeks! Cabbages! We will need these for the soup! The soup! It's free. It's free. This guy probably spent months trying to plant this shit and I'm just taking it for free! Potato! Potatoes! Remember, 
spoiler mash on the list. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, see you in the next one. All right, bye guys.